Okay, all in favor say aye. Aye. Urban County Council voted to move forward with downtown's distillery project Thursday. We talk about jobs, talk about economic development, and that's one issue we, we, we hope that's going to be provided when the distillery district is brought to us. Distillery project director Barry McNeese says he's confident it will bring jobs and more. There's places for artists, uh, entertainment, residential lofts, and really cool buildings, um, and it's all sitting there on the creek that Lexington was founded on. Council approved two portions of the project at a total of 2.1 million. This is the first truly leap forward as far as actively becoming engaged alongside us and trying to create a, a pedestrian friendly corridor uh, that plays to the advantages of history. Council also approved 12.7 million to improve three major portions of downtown. We don't have ADA compliant intersections. Our sidewalks, the pavers are in very poor condition in most of downtown. In some areas you don't even have a large enough space between tree pits or other obstacles to get a get a wheelchair through. Construction on West and East Main Street, Vine Street, and Cheapside is expected to begin soon. Will you be able to get around quite as well as you do today when the projects aren't? No. However, the construction on Main and Vine will be permitted. It will only be allowed on one side of the street at a time. The construction will only be taking place between 9 in the morning and 3 in the afternoon to ease traffic tension downtown. In Lexington, Kate Slattery, ABC 36, your local news source.